Hey ya, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. Alright you guys, I just got back home from out of town. I went to the desert for the first time ever. I didn't really get a town because I didn't get to stay under the sun that much because the original plan was we were all supposed to go biking. But then the wind was too strong so we just all ended up staying in our airbnb but it was still fun because we had a movie marathon we had barbecue we had the dogs so yeah pretty good out of town trip now i'm feeling refreshed i'm feeling like i'm ready to record some more content and that's it <laughs> anyway all right guys um so we are continuing our grand theft auto adventure escapade if you will and Seems like we're getting ready for another heist, so let's get right to it. I'm famous! I've been on the news! <laughs> Not because of good reasons, Trevor! Steal this car. house isn't it you like it I'm selling it you want to buy it I'm downsizing no no I'm good I used to sell houses like this all the time okay I sold dreams I made I bikes dreams. meaningful I'm not sure about that how much you like you like beautiful things though don't you sure well I just happen to know the most beautiful woman you want a bouncy bouncy Josh. Josh Bernstein. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the Josh Bernstein. Yeah, I never heard of you. Oh, yeah. well, I used to be a big deal once yeah. in real estate. And so that I sounds like something Trevor would say. Taken away. My meal ticket. Where's the chick? I'll get to that. I'll get to that. See, it's not really, it's not really money that I'm after here. It's just it's a little something more awkward than that. Now, Lenny Avery. <laughs> he... He was my best friend. And now, he has taken all of my clients. All of them. What a friend. Do you what a think friend. that you could take out all of his for sale signs? That was easy. She's worth it, man. I love you. I love you. I love you. Lenny. Avery. <laughs> Did he just keep saying I love you to me? Well, <gasps> was that car pink? For sale signs that are located on the northern area of the city. Okay, all right. But first, I want to get that car. Oh, shucks. Oh, there, 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 there. No, this wasn't it. I could have sworn I saw a car with like a pink lining to it. Oh well. Anyway. Alright, let's go to... Ooh, what's this? Nigel. Uh, we'll do that later. Let us first... Go to Lenny. Uh, go to Michael. Black, white, yellow, or young. <laughs> this game, Talaga. 
Hi, Michael. Hey, man. Fuck. Great what do you action. want? I'm your friend. I don't want anything, man. Come on, your company's good enough, huh? Same as always. Yeah, thanks. I really appreciate that. So, family ain't back yet, huh? <laughs> nope. Oh, she's a goddamn fool, man. Despite all the chaos of these last few weeks, I think I finally figured it out. I know. No. Sounds ridiculous. No, actually, it does not sound ridiculous, you know? Because you... You're a killer. You know? You are a man of action! You do not sit on couches, you take scores! You're back, man. We are back! All right? Mm -hmm. All we gotta go do is bust out Brad, and then we're golden, man! Franklin, he makes us multicultural. Lester makes it cyber. We're like modern America. We just get ourselves a gay friend. Bam! No, it's not it. I got money. It just makes you miserable. I want to make movies. Great. It's great. And uh, so where exactly yep, does this I bet he does. the second act of your life? We're going to do this last big job, and then we're going to dissolve the partnership. This is not a game to me. All right, this is a fucking way of life. I got a <laughs> fucking family. Yeah, well, I got nothing. No one gives a fuck about me. I do. Oh. Fuck wow. You. <laughs> I saw your grave. I mourned you. And then it turns out that everything I fucking thought about you was wrong. Everything. Dead, and you're not a man. Well, what the fuck are you? I'm your fucking nightmare. Yeah, enough with your goddamn threats. Bro. That was pretty heavy. <laughs> I mean, let me just ask you something. All right, something I've been, I've been thinking about. Up in North Yankton, exactly... Who was buried in your place? I never gave it any thought. You know what I'm thinking? I had no clue. You treacherous piece of shit! You're fucking dead! You're fucking dead! Oh, fuck. Oh, I can't relate. Hey, I haven't geez. played any of the old games. Go to Sandy Shore and there you go. On the inside, you're all action. Wait, actually, Do let's turn off the radio in case he talks. Or in case someone calls us. There we go. <laughs> I figured. You. Hey, come on. Where you going? You know where I'm going. Fuck you. You don't need to go all the way to North Yankton to find out what I can tell you over a couple beers back in my house. Come on. We'll order pizza. Fuck we'll order you. pizza. Fuck your pizza. Fuck everything it stands for. This is insanity. Oh, no. No, it's clear and reason thought. Finally. Come on. Come back. We'll talk. I'm not going to listen to another one of your lies. Hey, I'll lay it all out for you, everything. Turn around. I'm going up there to see it for myself. You'll be disappointed. <laughs> oh, I'll be something. It'll be an anti-climax. The grave's empty. Just a bag of sand, something like that. Just smoke and mirrors. Ooh, the lies! How do you do it, man? The game is up. I'm trying to save you a trip. You've done me enough favors, buddy, all right? Save your fucking breath. Trevor, come on. Fuck you, Michael. Soon enough, I will. Did he just say he will F Michael? Trevor? It's great to, uh... There a plane I can use? Get me across country? Sure. Sure. We got one fueled up for a trip south of the border. I'm taking it. Is everything okay, man? Everything is not okay. Nothing has ever been okay, but I gotta see it for myself. I'm gonna see an old friend, all right? You're where I think you are, buddy. I don't know why Oops. I didn't see it. I guess, I guess I didn't want to. Fuck! Maybe I knew all along. I'm gonna find out for sure, and I'm gonna do something about it. There's always something wrong with that job. 
what went down after, I guess. I guess I wanted to believe fucking... Fucking Flea Circus! Idiot! 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 I'm sorry, Trevor. I feel like Trevor's having a mental breakdown. Okay, we're near. Oh my gosh, we're gonna have to fly again. It's okay. I feel like last time actually, I think I did a pretty good job flying the helicopter. Or wait, that wasn't the helicopter. But I don't really know what. I, what? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I spoke too soon. I jinxed it. I jinxed it. What a... What a B word! Okay. Oh, shocks. It's this one. I forgot. <laughs> this, was the one, this was the one where I kept... We got it. <laughs> this was the one. This was the very first plane I flew. It's funny. Oh, it's raining. Is this supposed to rain? I don't think it's supposed to rain. Okay. I don't know if the raining is part of... Oh, Sir T, there's some Chinese guys looking for you asking where you're flying. I think it's Cheng's people. I didn't tell them. Tell where you was going, I swear I didn't. Oh! Oh no! I almost fell. Okay, let's just face the yellow on the map. London Wharf, North Yankton. Luden, Ludendorff, London Dor. Oh, okay. At least we didn't have to land. That's good. Michael Townley, husband, father, friend. Oof. Who you got in here, huh? As if I need to ask. <coughs> This is a pretty serious chapter. Hey, you're wasting your time. Is that why you flew out here? Huh? Tell me I'm wasting my time? Go ahead, dig it up. 
I don't give a shit. Yeah, that's what you look like. The guy who doesn't give a shit. That's ridiculous. How long are you gonna keep lying for, Mikey, huh? When's it gonna stop? What happens in the dark comes out in the light. I'll give it a rest, Trevor. There's nothing there. This is it. Moment of truth. As if I didn't know. Brad! Oh, the guy Look, in prison! We do what we gotta do to survive. This thing the guy didn't work out prison. the way it was supposed to. Oh, how was that, huh? With Brad in the can and me in the ground, or, 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 or both of us in the coffin? Brad got shot. You saw it. He didn't make it. I got shot, I did. That's, that's it. I think the only thing that didn't go as planned was me showing up on your doorstep 10 years later. Mikey, I mourned you. And I missed you. But I got a fucking family, Trevor. We were all gonna die. He did die. You reptilian motherfucker! Ooh. I didn't want it to come to this. Yes, you did! You just don't have the fucking balls to do it! But I do! I got more to lose than you. Never a truer word has been spoken, brother. Now pull the fucking trigger! Don't! You ain't got the guts. Take the fucking shot! Who is that? Fuck! Oh! Fuck! Joe Phillips! Mr. Cho has requested a word! Hey, ho, ho! I'm not the guy you're looking for! Hey, how's it been? How's it been? Get He's the over boyfriend. here. He's over here. Boyfriend. Get, Get the boyfriend! <laughs> Get in the car! Oh yeah, it did. Nice. Fuck off, you confused pieces of shit. Give yourself up. Oh, oh. <gasps> I didn't see them. Okay, let's try. I'm pretty sure there's gonna be a headshot um, criteria, so I kind of want to try to get at least ten headshots. Phillips went that away. 
Oh, ah, you want a boyfriend, huh? You don't want to die. Well, so Me and Trevor, we ain't friends no more. This is someone, huh? Is it not exploding? I don't think the cars are exploding. Back to Sandy Shores Airfield. Stall low airspeed. Trevor Phillips Industries. Mr. Phillips, this is Wei Chang. You know my eldest son, Tao? Yeah, the ex-nut. Backed out of a contract we agreed on. How is he? Still learning the ropes, thank you. My friends miss you in North Yankton. I was hoping we could talk. Ha 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 Was that your people? Ah, oh, of course. Sorry I had to cut out. <gasps> your oh operation causes <laughs> problem for me. That's so bad, Trevor. I want to expand into Blaine County, but your business and your temperament prevent me from making inroads. Oh, well, too bad. I don't know what you can do about that. I've already done something. We have your lover. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. My lover? My we Cody have Santa. your lover! You live in your trailer together with the maid. And then you were alone in that big house. Well, you're clearly very close. You know, how much will you give up 
for his safety. <laughs> My lover! Yeah, right! It's a tough break. I never want to double-cross a friend and put him in danger, but you gotta do what you gotta do. My business ain't going anywhere. I'm serious about this. He Sorry, will go die. The bridge. Tell him I love him dearly. Nice. Whoa, are you really gonna let Michael die? Trevor, come on. A crazy man, meet me at my crib. Me and Frank go, go and roll uh, on the last car for the rich dude. You in? Okay. Yo, 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 yo! <gasps> oh my god! Okay. Here we go again with the landing. Okay, here we go. Dispatch, you have a location for the suspect. Mission pass, very much. <laughs> Bet, I should get go. I forgot how to put down the wheels. Weren't you supposed to like press the down button or something? Anyway. D Nigel. This F. Guess let's just get a car. Too bad we're not a cowboy and we can't just whistle for our ride. Okay. Oh, you know what? You could just call for a cab. Believe it or not, I need a cab. Of course. Driver should be with you soon. Much obliged. We want to go to Devon. Okay, where do you guys think the cab's gonna go? Here or here? I think the cab's gonna appear on this side. Yeah, got to be from this side, right? Oh, no, that's not. Okay, we're better off running to our car <laughs> at this point. Patricia! Patricia! Mrs. Madrazo! Trevor! Oh, I miss you. All you boys. I miss you too. I, c I can't speak for the other... boys. You're such good friends. Uh, it's a bit more complicated than that. Actually, Michael and I... Uh, not speaking. Old friendships cannot be replaced. Hey, how are you? Is Martin looking after you? He's here. Oh my god! I got to go. 
This is what I really love, Patricia. It's so... It's actually pretty sweet. You can hear how sweet he is to her with his voice. Let's just call the cab again. Would you send out a cab post-haste? On its way, sir. Thanks for calling. Glad to hear it. Cab's gonna come from here! Oh wait, no, that's not it. <gasps> How did you just pop up out of nowhere? Where can I take you? Chamberlain Hills. Right away, sir. Okay, let's skip it. Let's skip it, even if it's gonna cost us. A I, I bet it's eighty dollars. What the fudge? $94? That's expensive. Lamar Davis, what's up? I'm part of the team. That's what's up. Team? I don't do teams. Uh, Devin Weston's car still in team? The one Frank's running. Oh, oh yeah, oh. that one. Hey, look, I boosted the ride. I'm about to meet your boy Franklin, and I need your ass to pick up the Packer, meet us outside the garage, and we taking these motherfuckers up to Polito Bay. All right, buddy. <laughs> the voice That's actor Lamar. Trip. Love him. Wait, I might have um, a talk. Wait, are we? Okay, we're Franklin. Yep, we're Franklin. Time to pick up the... Oh, wow! That is a... Oh my god, I like this car. He waiting at the garage. The boost, homie. How'd it go? Any problem? You know me, fool. Yeah, I do know you, fool. So what you think? <laughs> you know me, fool. I'm thinking where the blood stains and the bullet holes and shit. Man, fuck. That app. Put your shit behind me. I'm a professional now, like you and them old boys. So tell me what happened. I saw the ride. I took the ride. No drama. No security. No one saying, who the fuck is this gangly motherfucker doing in my car? Nothing. That's worrying, man. That's some shady ass shit. Man, chill. Yeah, it is shady. It's sus. Hmm. Line it up Over on here. the carrier, homie. My favorite gangbangers. That's teamwork, motherfuckers. Boss man's happy, then we'll get moving. And this old bust ass nigga ain't no boss. Enough, nigga, get your ass in the truck. Let's go. Okay. Oh, why this am I not Franklin? Let obey. Sonora Freeway. Go to the drop off. Hey, it's uh cozy in here. Scooch up, homie. Yeah. Scooch over here. Scooching in that crazy dude? Oh, hell no, that nigga stank. Get over here. I don't <laughs> fight. That ain't what I heard. All cannibalistic and shit. Frank, what you been telling him? I say what I see, homie. You dig on man meat. Ah, uh, rumor and hearsay. We got a long way to go. I'd get comfortable. All right, nigga, but don't try nothing. How far is <laughs> it? And this thing? Yeah, about four hours. Shit, it's your operation, Slick. Shit, if you all right driving, I'm gonna catch up on some sleep. Go for it. It's all right being the boss. Meant to be running mm. things, but this fool sleep. Yeah, I'll be asleep when your ass stop talking, nigga. Some boss. 
some balls. Hey man, where that other dude? The dude that creeped on that dude. Michael, his creeping days are done. Well, what you mean? He stopped creeping? No more creeping for him. He like retired from from creeping. From everything. That's funny, cause like the boy Frank didn't miss a shit about that. And as a oh, I didn't fact, see I that car. Dude, but considering the mutual acquaintances we got, I would have liked an invite to the retirement party. There were no party. No party? I used the term retirement euphemistically. Homie, for a dude that kills dudes and eats dudes and fuck dudes, you talk fruit. It's unconfirmed. <laughs> What's unconfirmed? The fact that you talk stupid or the fact that you do some messed up shit? Or where the other dude's at? Like, maybe he's dead. The last one. Oh shit, man. Fuck. Do Frank know about this? I don't know if Franklin knows, but let's just let him sleep. Shit. Yeah. Bummer. But you know, he wasn't a good guy he made out. Man, dude was a killer, a thief, a liar, and irritable as shit. Yeah. A liar. Above all else, a fucking liar. Homie, you sound like some bitch he ain't called. Like, oh, he lied to me. I am some bitch he didn't call for 10 years. <laughs> oh, he fuck, lied man, he to me. You. The fucker got fucked. Damn. He fucked the fucker himself. Shut up. Oh man, the first time's always special. I hope he was gentle with you. Enough of that. And enough about me fucking. I don't do that. As a rule, maybe when I got to LS, I was I was a little overwhelmed by the place. I got a little out of control. But that ain't who I am for the most part. But the Michael fucked you. Yeah. The Michael fucked me. And the Michael fucked Brad. And the Michael ran off with the FIB. Brad? Who who the fuck is Brad? Brad is our boy back from the day. And Michael killed him? Michael got him killed. He died when Michael faked his death. I thought Michael died and Brad was in the pen, when actually Brad was in the ground and Michael was in hiding. And now Michael's dead and it's all okay? Michael's current condition is unconfirmed. I said that. <laughs> but if he was dead, you'd be cool because of this Brad dude who died whenever. <sighs> yes. Man, I thought you and Michael were tight. So did I. Okay, that make a lot of fucking sense. Damn. It's a lonely old Trevor road, really is it? pissed with Mom? Michael. Hey, I couldn't say. I mean, not really. A road's a road. It ain't got abandonment issues. What the heck? Black top making do. I don't need to make do. I need to make snaps on these rocks. Sure. Yeah, the time will come. It's what happens before we get paid is what? Franklin's asleep. It's just me and you. What? What you trying to say? You want me to jack you off or something? Jesus, no. God, no. Oh my God, not. Lamar! Unless... Man, you's a sick fiend. Just fiending for you's some a friendship. Sick fiend. Friendship? Right, whatever, man. It's just... Truckers are a symbol of this country. And a part of its mythology like cowboys, gangsters, hobos, gangbangers. Truckers are about the unsexiest myth I ever heard. Apart from hobos. Uh, maybe tied with hobos. Freedom. Loners in the night. You know what truckers do? Cut up women and get other dudes to jack them off. Come to think about <laughs> it, aside from not lugging freight around the country, you got about all the necessary prerequisites for a fine career in haulage. No shame in that. If you don't huh. want to get paid or enjoy human contact. Money's bullshit. So is friendship. All right, all right, all right. I see you still touching. How's Franklin doing over there? Ah, uh, dude getting paid to sleep. Don't even worry about him. Ah, uh, the sleep of innocence. So he, like, in charge on this one? You work for him? He's a kind of figurehead. A puppet, if you like. With Devin Weston's hand up his ass. Right yeah. up to the elbow. That dude, real shame. Ooh, yeah, I don't like possum, Devin. He's kind but, of a dick. Well, once he's paid us, he can be whatever we want him to be. What you want him to be? I want him to be someone who understands that all the money in the world can't save him from a nasty guy who thinks he's an asshole. Now that's something I want to see. So, uh, tell me, man, how y'all end up meet? Michael introduced us. Me and Frank didn't exactly travel in similar circles. Nah, I mean the creeper. Michael? Ha! <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Yeah, you know. Sorry, I don't want to reminisce. The wounds ain't healed. You're such a delicate little bitch, ain't you? 
Where your pussy at? What you got in there? Screw you. That's where you poo? Uh, where you pee? Yeah. Where you kitty cat at? He's probably playing me from the start. Right, yeah. Probably. How you doing? Where? When? All right. All right. Fuck. I was running this small air freight outfit in North Yankton. Tiny operation. There's one beagle I could borrow when I needed it. We were kids. Kids with planes. So, this guy I know says there's this other guy needs some hot cargo moved across the border. Money's good, and I don't know enough to check references, so I'm in. A few days later, I'm waiting on the runway, and I see this dust coming up off the road. Only, it ain't one dust trail, it's two. I got told one guy in cargo. First car comes through the gate, stops, someone comes out. My age, just 20, kind of fat but strong under me. Love at first sight. Yeah, something like that. Other car comes through the gate. Old guy falls out, starts yelling, waving his arms, and pointing at the kid. The dude that got Jack? Who fucking knows? Fat guy's running, old guy's shouting. I don't really care. I play peacemaker. Concerned citizen. I get close to the old guy and I pull out this flare gun I'm carrying around, squeeze the thing off in his eye. Oh shit, what's happening? Wake up, you dozy motherfucker. One time was on a ride. This is what happens when you fall asleep on the job. What you gonna do? Okay, shit. I got an idea. Keep driving. I'm gonna take the tricked out JB700 and get rid of the tail. Devin's lawyer said there'd be some new hardware on board. Hey, take this headset. Because of his stolen cars, okay. Well, what exactly is the definition of a hood? Not the clothes definition. Those vehicles are stolen. Pull it over. Mount the fire, the mounted gun to drop spikes. Uh, press L B. Damn, so this buck wasn't here before. Man, you brought the cops right to us, dog. Maybe you should have done a boost, Mr. CEO. Now get on your own. the GOH. Man, the cops was all over us. They slowed us down soon. That's not surprising. The insurance companies have been pressurizing them to find you since the studio break-in. You knew there'd be heat? Man, you could have told us. Don't get emotional. We're waiting at Procopio Truck Stop. Be here soon. The lawyer... It's up at the Procopio Truck Stop. Roger that. What the? What in the world? Yo! Hey, my whip! Oh. 
Okay. Go on ahead. I'll be right behind you. Wait for him. I kind of feel like I just want to let him go ahead so that I, I can just... Let's give it five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm gonna speak to the legal counsel woman. Get us paid. Yeah, oh my goodness, I hope they pay us. Shit. Just make sure it's fair salary for the workforce, motherfucker. Yeah, what he said. You taking care of. Head back to town. And there she is. Whoo, Molly. Please give me some good news. Hello, Franklin. Yeah, where Devin at? Somewhere meditating or ripping somebody off? In light of the drama your efforts caused, we felt it was not perhaps the best idea for you two to be seen together for a while. Where's the money? Mr. Weston is one of the most brilliant investors the world has ever known. He's obviously a maverick, but he's also rigorous in his research. Yeah, he may be brilliant. Look, let me be the first to tell you. He ain't gonna fall in love with your ass. Now, where the fuck is my money? The best thing that could have happened to you in the situation has happened. He is going to hold your money, invest it in his Alpha Fund, and make the funds available to you at a time as the transfer will not induce any undue attention. Which is a polite way of saying I'm getting robbed? Are you fucking kidding me? That is a short-sighted and frankly immature way of seeing things, Mr. Clinton. Let's go. What the heck? And pop, motherfuckers. Maturity is not really my fucking thing. Damn, we got rock. Oh my goodness, I want to kill Devon. Compromise, not a scratch. It's <laughs> my fault. Mission time. Oh, you know what? Since we're here, we might as well start this one. Oh, Lester. Franklin. What's happening, Lester? Hey, look, you seen Michael? Man, the contact he set me up with is holding out on the payment, dawg. Huh. Um, let's see. His phone is offline. His cra- I'm so sorry. Oops. Are you hurt? Ay, Dios mio. Oh, wow, it just- Hey, the doctor fools like me. Oh, no, I lost Lester. I wanted to stop the- I thought the car would stop right in front. Oh, man. The conversation with Lester didn't happen!
<laughs> Let's go here. Oh no! He disappeared! Oh wait, no, he's not. He's just there. We out here. Yo. Nice. Sorry. <laughs> oh wait, it's probably these people. What you do that bad. for? Do what? What a loser! What you call me? Want a black guy? Uh, 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 seven uh, 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 Who you think you fight, uh, fool? Oops. Let's go get the let's go get these motor boats. Okay. <laughs> that was so dumb. Anyway. I thought, uh, frankly, let's go here. I wonder if there are sharks in this game. I wonder what's faster. Oh my gosh, you know what? What are these called again? <laughs> I forgot. I was thinking of motorcycles, but no, those are the two wheelers. Speedboat? Is this called speedboat? I forgot. I actually, I remember writing one of these as a kid, but I was like, like even before high school. Now I don't really remember what it feels like to write one of these. Man, I'm nowhere near. Okay, fine. Let's just... I want to take a cab. Maybe there's gonna be a cab right here. I actually want to go home first because I want to take a nap. Well, not a nap, but I want to sleep. I want Franklin to sleep. Whoa, is this a party? Man, I'm getting tired of the grind every day. I want to get in my friend. Oh my fucking god! You reach out. Nice. We got a buggy, or yeah, that's what it. Well, that's what these are called, right? A buggy. You know, if you stare at the screen long enough, it starts to get hypnotizing watching Franklin ride the bike. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? Baby, what are you doing? The neighbors are gonna see this. You're always at that fucking golf course. That's it. Walk away like you always do. Hey, you, listen, can you give me a ride? My wife's gone crazy. I'll throw some dollars your way. All right, man, I gotta find some wheels first, dog. Okay, I'll wait here and take a good long look at my life, strewn all over the front yard. <laughs> oh, for real? We need a car. Whose car can I steal? 
Also, what's wrong with that bike? That was a pretty nice bike. Okay, let's get this car. my bike Ugh, not worth it i'm not gonna help strangers anymore also why is this my outfit like i don't remember switching to this outfit at all is this because we did the parachute diving thing okay there we go Save and then we'll change our outfit and then oh my gosh, why don't you use your blanket, Franklin? Oops. Well, oh, I'm at PC. Mm, let's check out casual jacket. Here, <laughs> I like that. I like this one. Let's go. Okay, now it's time to go to Franklin. Rolling, 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 rolling. Perfect landing on that car. <laughs> Sorry, mister! Oh, fuck! It's just a car, man! Get out of the car! Oh! My god, is she pregnant? I'm so sorry, ma'am. But that car just ran her over, so... I mean... Who's the real evil one there? <laughs> Probably us both, because we both did bad things, but yeah. Ooh, Franklin's house. It's gonna have to go out. We are women. Here are pain. We are women. Here are shop. We are women. Have no doubt. We are women. We are free. We are Shut women. the are fuck men. up. Thank you. Whoa. Oh, my N word, huh? <laughs> my N word. Call me, huh? <laughs> Trevor, what, what the heck? When a friend makes a mistake, huh? No, <laughs> really? Oh, no. What? oh, so what? It's just me getting hurt? Is that funny? No, huh? man. Well, fuck you! I'm gonna put you in the fucking ground. You laugh at me again. Man, calm down. I have met a lot of assholes in my life, but you, oh, you're not long for this world if this is the way you fucking act. You little jumped-up motherfucker! Look, Bro. how about this, man? Calm down. It was funny at first, man. I made a mistake. Unfortunately, man, you failed. It was funny, all right? I, I apologize. I accept your apology. Okay? Trevor is so chaotic, so, I swear. Let's hug it out. Mm-hmm. Ah! Ah! Right? You're so fucking you're funny, gotcha! Huh? Oh, 
Fuck, no, I'm not funny. Fucking asshole. No. Oh, fuck. Dude, I, I think something I, is wrong oh. with Trevor. Childhood. Damn, man, you all right? Just, I'm just fucking on edge, you know? Look, I love you, right? But I would have... I would have... Look, fucking! Look, man. Lester said you had some information for us about Michael. Michael, mm. fuck Michael. I hope he's dead. Man, I know y'all too, man. Come on, man. You two had beef before. But what the fuck happened in North Yankton? Somebody pinched him, man. Who? My friend Ron met these Chinese assholes. They're from Yangshan in China. We had some problems. They mistakenly thought Michael was a human being and kidnapped him. Yeah. Oh my now God. it's like they holding him somewhere in the city. Yes. Come on, bro. Well, go fuck yourself. You want that piece of shit? That's your fucking business, all right? He's dead to me, all right? And chances are, if and when I see him, he's going to be dead to everyone else as well. Hey, come on, bro. Don't do that. You're pushing your luck, pal. Man. What was that? What? What was that? Uh, nothing. Oh! oh! Asshole! Everybody! Assholes! <sighs> Something's wrong with Trevor. Hey, it's me. What did Trevor say? Man, Michael's being held by a Chinese crew because of Trevor. The irony isn't lost. I'm sending you an app for your phone. Michael's cell just came back online. This will track its signal. It'll work better the closer you get. Be careful. Sure. Oh, wow. I told you! He ain't my g -la. Don't try to persuade me, you're not lovers. He's laughing at you, you fucking idiot! You're making a mistake! It costs a lot of money to track you down. I had to call in every favor I could in the Midwest. And then you kill several good men. Good day, huh? Good day. Good fucking day to you! Kill him! Hey, Trevor hey. Phillips isn't oh. coming. Whoa, 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 whoa! No, hey, hey! Hey! Hey, that's a big fucking mistake! Ooh! Franklin's here already? Oh, I thought. Launch Trackify from the bottom right of the phone app menu. Bottom right, Trackify. Goodness, this is a pretty difficult mission, ah. Wait, I think. Hey, he's in there somewhere. How you get in? Okay, maybe this ladder? Yo, 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 I think we're, we're on the right track. Don't I have a silencer? This is 
叫我共走。我们的人受伤了。救命了！去死！ You want me to waste the boyfriend? Oh, shucks! There's more guys. There you go. Yo! Nice. Trevor's friend. Sit over 
over here, man! Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on, let's go. This is my rescue mission, dog. We going. I just want to get home. I'm going to get you here. Nice. That it? We clear? Yeah, man, we clear. Fuck oh, me, man. What a scene that was. That's about the That was a fun mission. Shit. That yeah. was a very Whoa. fun mission. Back there on that meat hook, I thought it was over. When the dude had the knife on me, man, I thought the same thing. Frank. Thank you, bro. You didn't have to. Yeah, bro. Of course I did. If this shit means anything, shit, the second <laughs> I knew. Hey, how'd you even find me? Lester sent me this app that tracked your sales signal. Ah, Lester. But how'd you even know I got snatched up? Trevor told me. Kinda. I asked him what he knew about you disappearing in North Yankee. Yeah, I bet he wasn't that forthcoming, was he? Well, he told me in the end. How'd they pinch you? Oh shit. We're up there, and Trevor freaks the fuck out. He was about to kill me, Franklin. And then these Chinese guys show up, they take me, he fucks off. For real? Too real. Okay. Well, if you don't want to talk about that, how about Devin Weston? Weston? What about him? We delivered the last of them cars, only he ain't paid us yet. Says he gonna invest the fucking money. Well, he's a clever guy. You know, that might not be such a bad idea. Are you uh, fucking serious? Look, no, Michael. Franklin, you're gonna get your money, okay? The I don't trust the guy. You'll even get some interest, too. And I got this other deal with Weston down at the film studio. So we gotta wait for that to play out before I got any leverage over your deal. For real? Come on, Franklin. I had my feet chained to a meat hook for the last few hours. Give me some time. I'll figure it out. I promise. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Here we go. I think we're almost at Michael's place. We're home. All right, then I'll see you. Show. Hey, you sure you don't want to come in? What, your big empty ass house? Dog, I'm depressed enough already. All right. Well, listen, thanks. Look, man, before you go, what the fuck happened up there? I said, Trevor went crazy, tried to kill me, I got jumped by the Chinese. Man, before all that, I'm talking about the feds. Trevor, this guy Brad, man. I know what you meant. Look, I made a judgment call. I don't know if it was the right one. I did what I thought I had to do. I had a young family, Franklin. I was running with a crew of crazy motherfuckers with nothing to lose. I saw an out, a future for me, for my family. I took it. You took it? Man, you burned every motherfucker you've ever known. It was that or die. Ugh. Damn. Look, I know it sounds cold. I don't expect you to understand it. Not yet, but you will. When you got ties of your own. Look, you wake up one day, and, and your legs, they just give. You just can't run anymore. All right, man, look. You watch your back, all right? When Trevor finds out you're still alive, I don't know what the fuck he gonna do. 
Don't worry about Trevor. He's not gonna get near me. Hey, you watch your back. You hear me? Dog, it ain't me he coming for. We straight. It's you, dog. It's you. I'm just saying. Dude, I love how Franklin's like basically the, the best one among the three of them. Today's episode was so heavy. Woo, 90%. Nice. Headshots 10. Nice, 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 nice. We just had to up our accuracy. How many days has it been since the kidnapping? All right, you guys, I'm going to end it right here. Today's episode was pretty heavy. Like, Trevor, like, it's becoming more and more evident to me that apart from all the laughs, apart from all his antics, I feel like Trevor has mental health problems and he had a tough childhood. I remember I heard his story, like, he told it to the guy with the braids, the guy with the cousin. And he told it in the form of a, of a fairy tale. And it didn't really dawn on me that it was a sad story. But it really does seem like Trevor is going through something mentally. So I feel bad for the guy. And Franklin, Franklin's just the guy that is well-loved. Like, he's like the mediator between Mike and Trevor. And as for Mike, he did what he had to do for his family. And I get that. Even, I mean, I don't have a family of my own, but I, I get that. I get how, fam how family can change a lot of things and can change a lot of people. But oh my god, today's episode was kind of heavy. <sighs> what do you guys think? Anyway, um, that's my cue. I, my dog is here. He knows I'm done with my stream. And as always, if you guys like this episode, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below and hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.